yes, 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 I have a nostalgia problem. I'm just not ready to deal with it yet. But I would say that I was faced with a challenge and I don't know how to really explain this, but I'm gonna do my best to explain this. Okay, now you see this console. First of all, I can't even pronounce this name. Y'all probably could pronounce this better than me. Y'all just go in the comments and let me know how to pronounce this name. I'm just gonna, it, it's a, the O-U-Y-A, that's what I'm gonna call it. Well, me, I'm just gonna give it my own name. I'm gonna call it the little Odie, little Odie. And I'm maybe talking about Garfield the dog, little Odie. Odie was awesome. I don't know what to say in this case about this one being just as awesome as Odie was in the original cartoon. I'm not gonna say that this is totally like failure because it could have been my, well, it probably was my fault because I had made some decisions, did certain things, but I was able to figure it out. So enough of me trying to explain this a little bit. Let's get started. What is going on, you guys? Your boy Famous Kid Video Game Entertainment. And before we go any further, make sure you hit the like, subscribe button. Click like, subscribing is always a big help. Now, for me, when it comes down to collecting, okay, I started out. This is just me. I don't. I don't know if anybody else started off like this. I started collecting nintendo game and nintendo games led to like it was mostly like nintendo and super nintendo and sega those are my top three right there when it came down to collect those then i start going through collecting other systems and stuff like that until i start and then after i made it to a peak of collecting i wanted to dabble in looking for certain consoles that maybe nobody talks about anymore or also the fact is of consoles that I don't really, really hard to find. And that's just, that's just the way it is. It's like with me, it's like the hunt for the, the like the truest, the, the true rarest console there is. And it's not just like about like a console that's like so old. It's like, I don't even understand it or a console that, you know, I mean, it's gotta at least be able to, for me to play it or, you know, it, it, it's something's gotta be something like that, you know? So I've been eyeing this system for a while. I, I heard a lot. It, 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 it has some history to it. And because, and to me, this particular console was a console that I think that it stepped into an age that started other things. I don't want to just break into the specs too much and everything else, but it started other things. What, what gave ideas for consoles and stuff like that today for handhelds today. And which, which, uh, you know, I love. And I feel that this has its own respect it has its own piece part of that history and even though that it that people look at it as a failed console and i don't know the games i really i don't know but when i i had i had to get my hands on it and it took me a while to get a really a, a good one at a decent price shots out to retro c game and i was just like you know what i'm going for it i was like as long as it's working it's just there and in box <laughs> That's that's pretty good to a collector. So I wanted to I wanted to experience it. I wanted to experience this system for myself. I wanted to get down and see and 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 get a good feel for it for myself. I I've been hearing a lot about it back in the day. I even hear about it even on other you know some other videos and people talk about it how it was and how it just holds that that bit of nostalgia for us you know. And I wanted to experience it. I did you know there's a, and there's consoles out there like even like consoles that we like man like what the heck you ever played a jaguar yeah i played a jaguar because it's it holds that piece of nostalgia that is so well respected and i love it. according to the studies that i have been doing my little research on that this is android based so which means that it's dealing with apps and downloading and things like that and i don't know the i'm i'm thinking because i've been hearing that you know, you can kind of like set up some extra stuff on it. So I'm figuring that is easy. So one way for me to find out, let's go ahead and try to plug this thing up. Now I'm gonna plug this thing up to my capture device so we can get it up on the screen. And just like I said, you know me, when stuff like this comes in, I don't care about all this extra. I just want to plug it up and then get down. Let's see what's going on. And then I guess if I have to fix anything, I'll figure it out. Because as long as it work, not too bad right right got it all plugged up capture device oh yeah oh yeah it's time for the i ain't gonna pronounce this name it's time for the little odie it's gonna power it on so all right right little console lighting up and that thing's good 
All right, so we got we got something right here. Oh yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. This looks like. Okay. Let's see. Let me see if I can get my controller to work. Just a second. Let me break this out. So this controller, I just noticed that the controller doesn't have a start. But so okay. I think I'm not pairing. I'm 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 literally trying to pair this thing. I'm trying to. So okay. So we got this. Okay. All right. So okay. We got we got few little selections right here and let's see got discover got play so we got play we got this pick frog right here okay so we got some games okay all right all right let's see what we got here okay okay so we got that and what is a okay. you know sound i didn't i didn't turn up volume on this so hold on so now i got this volume working okay all right let's see what we have here Charles working all right nice pinball that's what i'm talking about Man, you guys play pinball? Oh man, so cool. All right, let's see if I can find something cool to play. Let's see. They're making you buy a pack. And I already know, and okay, I can use this free version, let's see. Oh, and it's not gonna. All right, so now here is where I just completely started to just screw this whole thing up okay first of all i just noticed that this is not this is somebody's account so and i i don't and i don't like doing that i don't like messing with nobody else's account regardless of the fact is that the online account is gone whatever this is not that i wanted to do a factory reset and set the whole thing up just new <laughs> because one thing i do with devices i don't like keeping other people's account so because I wouldn't want that to happen to me. So I making I made this decision to reset the factory reset this thing. And this is where, yeah, this is where I went completely. It just went just to the left field or right. The OD wasn't OD no more. It was just, it was, it went from OD to O dog. It's just went, it went down because I factory reset this thing. Now, I, I don't know why if there was another account and why it just but I but I guess I have to I have to understand that when you get these things, you had to sign in just like any other Android device or phones or whatever you have to sign in, you know. So so now I had to, I you know, since so I was just like, OK, I know there's some potential up in here because I know I can get this thing back on. So I did some research. It, it took me a while to figure this out. I mean, hours hours on end to figure this out but i was not gonna give up at first i was gonna be like you know what tell you what i got the i got the console i could just put it in the box not a big deal you know collectors i got it that's cool but no no i was not gonna do that because that's just not me i was not gonna give up no i felt that i wanted to experience this thing regardless even though the fact is even if i put like my own games on, i wanted to experience it i wanted to try this out so I finally got everything up and it took just like I said, it took a while. You have to do some things. You have to even go in the back end of your PC to stop certain things from happening just in order for you to basically talk to this this device and do some updates to to reinstall everything. Because come to find out, I guess that there was a there was I don't want I don't know if you want to say firmware that can that was able to go around it so it's not so it's not an account it's just basically just a back end to to um to set to set up things so you can go ahead and just start doing your emulation and stuff like that i can't explain as much because there's so much when it comes down to it but i was able to figure it out the good news is i was able to figure it out and that's the good thing because now i'm able to play some games now one thing I did learn, just like should have just known just by looking at it, is you you want to take advantage of the USB port in the back. So you're, you're gonna need a hub for it if you want to try to plug up other stuff or plug up other controllers. And this is in there. Now I didn't get that far at doing that. Me, I just wanted to. I wanted to try it out. I wanted to play some games. So I installed some games on the USB, and it's. I, I was trying to figure. It, and as I'm as I'm setting it up, as I'm basically setting this whole thing up. You're seeing it. I'm just, you know, I'm now still working on this. This is a work in progress. This is a work in progress to, to try to figure out everything that and how to install all the stuff that I need to install because it's so much easier on other devices to where you can 
set your bios you can like you know put where your folders is it's gonna find your folders and it, it just took me a, it's it, it takes a while to get it but once you get it the experience and it's gonna take some settings especially if you're used to uh faster devices as you notice in the beginning um this thing only got like one gig of ram so <laughs> i know that it's not gonna pump out like these amazing graphics and it's gonna pump out all this other stuff but it's cool to see this history of this to you know to try out some of these games and this and that and i, and I, you know, I try to play one of these old games and i mean the games is on here but I, I i really don't i didn't understand it and this is that and that but as far as the nostalgia part goes to like playing some of like my library games i thought that that was kind of cool that was really cool to to see that to to play to i guess to play the games that i love and stuff like that i i you know but I wouldn't, to me, and I'm still going to work on it because I really want to figure this out. And if you guys like to see stuff like this, you guys still want to see more of this device. More of the OD. More of the OD. Because it came back. Once it came back on, it, came, it turned back to the OD. So if you want to see more of, you know, of this device and see, like, you know, some of the work in progress that I'm trying to make on here to make this just like a really, really fun device. And I, I, I mean, and I'm thinking about maybe probably like maybe getting like you know um changing out the controllers because the controllers it has a it does i now was hearing about this that it has like a certain certain bit of lag to them but it seemed like it's decent but it's just it's just like i said it's a work of progress i mean so i want to see if i could probably like line up maybe like you know one of the xbox controllers and see how that lines up um what consoles that's gonna really work what settings I need to do to make everything look good and bounce. And, you know, just that way when I, you know, because it, it's, it's really small. You can pretty much put it anywhere. So if you have like maybe like you want to like install like maybe like one little console, like maybe like a Game Boy or something you can have on the screen. I think that this little device is pretty, is, is awesome. If you want to have it to where, yeah, you want to play like those handheld games or something or Game Boy Advance and you can put that in your bag or something like that. This whole thing is awesome. So I'm just, you know, so I, I'm, I really, I'm, I'm really curious about seeing other things that can possibly, you know, show off on this device and see, and, and really just really keep together and preserve that history because it's, it's worth it. It's worth that time. It's worth that fun. It's, it's to me, it's, it is, it's, it's really worth it, but it can, it's definitely a challenge. It's definitely a challenge. And you know, and that's nothing. We just got to have a patient and, and just keep going at it and keep, keep at it day to day. So, and I love it though, you guys, I hope you guys like it. I hope you guys like this little thing and how, and how it looks and the Audi and stuff like that though. So, all right, you guys, enough of me yapping and talking though. I'm going to be out though. All right. Thank you. You made it this far. And from Gamer to Gamer, peace out.